Yo, what's up, YouTube? This is your boy, Junior, a.k.a. Smoking Guns, out here in Tucson, Arizona, representing the Ultimate Trainer. So, it's been a while since I've been making videos. I've just been crazy busy at work. My work schedule is super hectic, and then I'm a full-time dad again, so my hours have been, like, super, super crazy. But I'm back on the grind, start trying to pump these videos out for you guys again to feed you guys this information. And what today's video is going to be on is how often should you be training heavy for bodybuilding? This is specifically for bodybuilding, all right? How often should you be training heavy for bodybuilding, all right? Now, when you're training for bodybuilding, going heavy as hell isn't your main obligation. That's not the goal, all right? Your main goal when you're doing bodybuilding is to create hypertrophy in the muscles, to be able to gain mass, to be able to gain size. And if you're trying to do that, you need to be keeping your rep range within a certain range. And that rep range is anywhere from 8 to 12 reps, all right? If you're going higher than that, you need to put on more weight so you can be able to bring it down to that rep range. Or if you're going lower than that, you need to be lessening the weight so you're able to bring it up to that rep range, all right? And what I like to do personally is because everybody still wants to get stronger even when you're doing bodybuilding you know you still want to be able to know that you are getting stronger in everything that you're doing and you are actually getting stronger even with that being said all right but you want to be able to sh see and show yourself that you are getting stronger so what I like to do personally is I like to give myself different training weeks when it comes down to those various compound exercises notice i said compound exercises i'm not talking about like isolation exercises like i'm not trying to do a friggin one rep max on a friggin leg extension or a hamstring curl or a friggin uh, dumbbell flies or anything like that nobody cares about that those specific exercises are meant for being able to build muscle all right to be, be able to create hypertrophy in the muscle you friggin try to do a damn one rep max on a friggin dumbbell fly you're gonna friggin tear your damn pec muscles all right but anyways like i said this is specifically for the compound exercises and what i like to do is like i said i'll give myself different training weeks so the first week i'll do anywhere from 8 to 12 reps all right second week what i'll do is i'll do anywhere from 15 to 20 reps and then that next week what i'll do is i'll do a five rep week all right. And within that five rep week, what I'll do is I'll pick a specific body part. Like I'll start with the chest for that one. All right. So on that week, when I'm doing that five reps for those uh, various compound exercises, I'll pick chest day where I'll do like a one rep max. And that'll help uh, give me uh, a good sense of how strong I've gotten. All right. And then the next week or not the next week, but the next week that I actually do that five rep week, I'll pick back day where I'll do a max on deadlift. And then the next time I'll do like a max on overhead press or the next week I'll do a max on squat and so forth and so forth. And what that does is it gives me a good generalization of how strong that I've gotten within those compound exercises. And like I said, when you're mixing it up like that, it will actually make you a lot stronger when you're going back to that regular eight to twelve uh, rep week and you'll notice that you've gotten substantially stronger when you're going down to that lighter weight all right so i hope this helps you out if this does help you out make sure to hit the like button make sure to subscribe to the channel if you haven't and make sure to hit me up all right if you got any kind of questions hit me up in the message uh the comment section hit me up with an email i always got you guys hooked up all right and make sure to hit up my sponsors hit up my sponsor rsp nutrition hit up my sponsor determined records and if there's anybody out here in the tucson arizona area you need ink, artwork done any tats make sure to hit my boy levi over at tattoo avenue he'll have you guys hooked up all right make sure to tell him junior sent you he'll have you hooked up all right so i hope you guys like the video i'll let your boy i swear, I swear. I swear. I swear. I swear.